All right, Shalom Rastafari. We've been scrolling here on the, uh, you know, on the internet, checking out some of the articles right here concerning um, uh, Gebra Medin, uh, the former Ethiopian Archbishop, his death right here. And these are some of the uh, pictures. This one, in particular. Um, <clears throat> Let's bring this one up. Some of y'all probably seen this particular picture um, as well. Right? Uh, this particular picture as well of uh, uh, the former Ethiopian um, Archbishop. We were reading something in the Ethiopic legends of the of Our Lady of Kedistin Gamaria. Um, one had pointed out that he had Caesar Bogiers here, or uh, you know, so forth and so on. We we don't really uh, can't see it too close, but it it um, would match what's been going on the apostasy that has been going on in Ethiopia. And we attempted to um, do as as our Master Yeshua HaMoshiach would have us do and speak the truth, the you know, and even through these particular means. Now. Um, when we read what we read, it, it's, it's just very, very, very shocking. You understand? In the Rayo Lemaria, or the Vision of Mary, it's the last couple of chapters in the Vision of Mary. Some of the brothers and sisters have it, and it's on the internet if one want to get a read of it. And actually, what we're going to do is uh, let's see if we can get our copy and actually speak on this um, momentarily but let us hold on this and let's just look over some of the other pictures that are going on now there's a another aspect to this that we want to speak on from daniel's prophecy daniel 11 and 43 is this year 2012 actually the fulfillment of daniel's prophecy 11 and 43 this is one of the questions that um, um spiritually inquiring minds want to know and as we get the the uh, Rayo Lemarium we want to also ask is the Rayo Lemarium is it actually speaking of this particular Ethiopian Archbishop when it speaks of a, a Papas who ends up in the Gehanima Isat and an Archbishop who ends up in the Gehanima Isat now we know that Melis and, 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 and Paulos, they were at enmity with the, 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 true, uh, the truth of Hylas Elasi the first. And that right there in itself is a very bad sign. But we recognize that since 74, 75, we are in this particular um, prophetic unfoldment of the last days and time so this is one particular photo right here um the, the machine is a little bit slow so please be with i and i so when we get to the the rayo lemarium let's get to the rayo lemarium and see what the rayo lemarium really has to say to us concerning these events and we want ones to um to judge for themselves and this is not about personal acrimony because personally um, we, we don't really you know there's no love or hate for this individual from a personal perspective there was a hope that this particular individual who was called the Archbishop of the Ethiopian Orthodox Church would do the right thing or the righteous thing However, from all the information and intel that we have been able to um, check out for ourselves, we do not see that um, to be. We do not see that to be the case. So it's interesting that when we look here, that actually let's see who we have right here. There's there's um, this uh, this is the the what you call Melis right here, Melis. Uh, Zanawi, right? Um, this is him right here, right? Again, and let's go further down, right here. 
let's see what else we have right here. Here's an interesting picture of Africa. So there's a couple of different ways to search this for, for photos. So as you can see, it's going into various other things. We just went to Ethiopia, um, Paolo's, and um, Melis, uh, Melis Des, right? And all right, so here we go, right? Here we go. Let's bring up Africa, the Great Lakes, and let's look at what we're speaking about right here. Because these prophecies, Libya or Egypt, Libya, and Ethiopia in prophecy, 2012. All right? That's what we want to touch on as well. Ethiopia, or rather uh, Egypt first, according to Daniel. And it's interesting if you look at this map right here, Daniel chapter 11, verse 43. It puts Ethiopia right here in Central Africa. Right? They say this is Abyssinia, according to this particular map. And what's interesting is that Sudan is right here. Sudan figures right here, right? All right. So um, we're going to come forward to this actually again. But um, let us pause for the cause for, for, a, uh, for a brief moment, should we?